in this video i will discuss how to assign the ip address and then how to establish the communication between the plc and the software in the previous videos we learned about the input wiring output wiring and the power supply right so accordingly i connected all the cables with the plc power supply analog inputs digital inputs digital outputs if you see i connected the ethernet cable also as i don't have the ethernet port in my laptop i am using a ethernet to usb converter this is optional if you have the ethernet port this is not required just directly connect the ethernet cable with the laptop or desktop first what i will do i will connect this usb cable with my laptop okay so the cable is connected and we need ip address subnet mask gateway values we have to enter these values in the laptop okay first turn on the plc then we have to note down the values from there i will turn on the power supply so the plc is started so go to network menu 1 2 3 network press okay again we have to go to ip address so press okay we need these addresses ip address subnet mask gateway we have to enter these values in the laptop okay so now i will go to the laptop and search for the settings go to settings in settings go to network and internet select this one right so if you see the first one is wi-fi for internet and the second one is ethernet port which i connected the usb cable if i remove the usb cable this will be gone i will remove it see there is no ethernet port now i will connect the usb cable again the ethernet port is came right see this is the ethernet port and go to the properties so this is the ethernet click here first we have to enter the dns server assignment click edit so it must be manual okay and enter preferred dns this one 8.8.8.8 total four eights okay and then save completed next assign the ip address again click edit this one you have to select manual and enter the ip address okay if you see what is the ip address on the plc so this is the ip address 192.168.03 we have to enter 192.168.0 the last number we have to change okay for example the plc is having three you can use four here five six any number other than three in network one device have one unique ip address okay you cannot use the same ip for another device so the plc is having three you can use here four five six anything i am just using ten and what is the subnet mask what is the value same we have to enter 255 255 255 0 
enter the same here subnet mask and gateway what is the gateway here 192.168.0.1 enter same address 192.168.0.1 then you click save we already entered the preferred dns before otherwise you can also enter here you click save that's it the ip assignment is completed the only one important thing we have to remember is the ip must be unique either plc or laptop software okay just some other number so the ip assignment is completed now open the software go to search and search for logo so open the logo soft comfort v8.4 so this is the software for programming the plc okay now go to tools and click ethernet it may take some time if you are using the demo version then this step is not required for you there are two settings offline and online go to online enter your target ip address the plc ip address what is the plc ip address it is 192.168.03 so enter the same ip 192.168.03 and connect if you see it is a tick mark came that means the software is connected with the plc you can do the programming you can do the download or you can do the upload the one thing you have to remember is if in case you are using an external converter then you must select the converter option in the above here here you must select the respect to converter name or option here this is my Wi-Fi router and this is the converter. In this video, we understand how to assign the IP address and how to establish the communication between the PLC and the software. I will meet you in the next video. Thank you.